Hey everyone, it's Steve here at the DJ Lab and I want to share with you a little tip and trick I just learned off of Instagram when I was watching Cleveland Terry share this tip here about Beatport Link and BeatSource and all the other streaming services and how to refresh your playlist over here on the side. Let me get right into it very quickly. We're going to jump over to Beatport. There's my playlist right now. I'm going to go into the all DJ charts. Let's look at something that from the past seven days, let's say. Let's go into the genres. Let's do some funky house. See what we have under the funky house. Back to the groovy chart. Let's do that one. And all you gotta do is add to the playlist and you just say create a playlist, back to the groovy chart, save the changes and we've got it. So when I go in here, it's right at the top nine tracks. But here is where the problem comes into play. If I go into my Serato, I'm gonna look down and I had to do a retake on this. So right here, you see that chart we just made is already in my playlist, unfortunately. But all I did was went into my gear icon under music streaming where it says music streaming. I just literally turn that off, click yes, and then we turn it back on. And when you look down, you're going to see it's actually there, which of course we already saw earlier. But like I said, I had to do a retake because I was having issues here with Serato. Thanks to Cleveland Terry for sharing this tip and trick on his Instagram. I'm sure he's probably got it on his YouTube channel as well too. Make sure you hop over to his YouTube channel and subscribe if you haven't already. This guy's got some of the best tips and tricks and reviews that you can find on YouTube. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit the alert button so when I make new videos, you know what's up. I will talk to you all later and have a good one.